And after investigators found that cocaine laced fentanyl as the reason five people died in that apartment building in Commerce City, we're taking a closer look at the epidemic in our state. Shannon Weir joins us now. She's a registered nurse and director of clinical education with Gallus Medical uh, Detox Centers. Good morning, Shannon. Good morning. How are you? I'm good. Uh, you know, this is such a serious issue. Death by fentanyl is becoming far too common. Uh, can you tell us why fentanyl is so dangerous? Yeah, fentanyl is about 100 times stronger than morphine. And some people don't know like what that means. Morphine is about um, one and a half times stronger than oxycodone, which most people kind of understand the oxycodone a little more. It's incredibly strong, um, way more than the normal drugs people would be using. And how prevalent is it on the streets? It's very prevalent. Um, that's what I know the DEA is finding most things now are, are actually laced with or um, the opioids people are buying are fentanyl. In our facilities, um, that's the majority of what we're seeing with these patients is that they're taking fentanyl, not other um, opioids. Mm -hmm. You know, in the case of this Commerce City, the five deaths there, you know, these people were snorting um, cocaine, possibly thinking that it was just cocaine. Can we talk about the lacing of it? You know, what that does and maybe, you know, why is it being laced? You know, it's being laced because it, it does give people a different high um, and it also then gets people um, addicted to opioids unknowingly. And um, so we're finding a lot of things being laced, even um, benzodiazepines, cocaine, and people don't have any um, tolerance. Their, their receptors are very naive to the opioid and that's why they, they overdose um, so quickly from it because they had no idea they were using an opioid. Right, so do you think people know that it's laced with fentanyl or are they just buying it cocaine, just thinking it's just that? I think most people think that they're just getting cocaine. That's what that's what we're finding with people is they have no idea that it's laced with fentanyl. Yeah, that is really awful. I mean, um, mm -hmm. you know how we, we talked just now about the city of Denver releasing a new bill where they're going to have Narcan available for people mm -hmm. and they'll be able to watch a five minute video. Um, you know, how else can people get help? Um, so you can go to detox. You can get help with um, coming off of these substances. Um, this is what we do um, at Gallus Detox and there's a lot of fear of withdrawal symptoms, which is why we specialize in this, and especially with fentanyl, um, for helping people get off comfortably. Um, so we, we have a number, 888-306-3122, that people can call and um, you know reach out for help um, because there's, there is help out there. Yeah, there is help, and it's truly just become such an epidemic, not just in Colorado, but the entire country. Mm -hmm. Shannon, thanks so much for your insight. All right, thank you.